Yes, there is a new Jam Recorder out now, Jam Recorder 2.0. I have several videos out that will teach you how to download and use Jam Recorder. So in this video, I'm going to show you what's new in version 2.0. If your Jam Recorder doesn't have 2.0 at the top, go to jamrecorder.com to get your new version. First, you'll notice the buttons on the right hand side of the text field labeled with an FX. Version 2.0's effect is reverb. If you click the FX button, you'll notice that reverb turns on. Now your vocals will sound so much better, your acoustic guitar will smooth out and sound less harsh. You can apply reverb to anything that plays on the track that you've highlighted. Just remember that you have to have the reverb button on when you export your song. Reverb isn't applied if you record with it on, it's applied upon export. Another feature we've added is loopability. I'll show you what that means with these drums on my desktop. I'll import them into Jam Recorder and click play. You can see they, they're exactly one measure long. Now I'll change the file name from drums.mp3 to loopdrums.mp3 with a capital L. Now we'll import the file and play it. Now it loops perfectly. No need to make five minutes worth of drums to jam along with. Final feature is an export progress bar. Jam Recorder adds reverb upon export so this will show you when it's done. Thanks for all your emails. We're still working on Jam Studio and Jam Recorder to make them exactly what you want them to be. If you have any ideas or questions, email me at clintjamstudio.com.